welcome to my channel love for animals and today's video is about deworming your puppy so you have came across the word deworming your puppy it's very much important and essential for your dog to get dewormed and if you are first time pet owner it's very hard for you to understand what is actually the meaning of this deworming so let's see that when as we are human child we also get dewormed with albendazoles so human dewormers are available like new worms we use them to keep our child or our childhood safe from any kind of infections of the helmet helmets okay helmets are like liver flukes then worm tip worm this kind of worms infest our intestine and this will prevent us from absorbing the all the nutrients whichever food we intake so in child in their growth growth time it's very much important to get them dewormed so that they can absorb all the nutrients whatever they eat they can use it in their max to max level so similarly in our dogs deworming is very much important as we know that dogs get infected with tapeworm hookworm heartworms all the worms over here are not similar as human worms okay so if you think that you can deworm your pet with human dewormers you are not very much successful in deworming your pet because human dewormers are only for few specific kind of worms and as we are human we never eat the teats and fleas from our body or from any food we never do that we never do that for that reason we are not that much heavily interested with the worms as much as our dogs get infected so it's very much important to deworm your dog so now it comes that how to deworm your puppy right so from age of 20 days your puppy shall be started deworming okay deworming is needed to be done before vaccinations also before 3 days of vaccination means you will give the vaccine before that 3 days you have to give the dewormer once so here comes the rules of the dewormer so see from number 1 point i am going to discuss first okay it is about the age of the puppy from when you shall start deworming must start deworming from the age of 20 days of your pup okay if you have brought your pup more than 20 days then it's fine no problem but still if you have got your puppy in 20 days which i really do not prefer you must not get a puppy before 1 to 2 months before that it's all the responsibility of the breeder or the foster parents and the dog must be kept with their mom okay it's very much important so that they do not get any kind of weakness in their body because if they do not eat the milk drink the milk from their mom they will not grow their immunity and there is no such food in the world that who can which can give the supplement of their mom so it's much much better if your puppy stays more 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 and more times with their parents okay with their mom because it will grow their immunity and they will learn few things how to behave with humans how to behave with their chewing problems and it will also get reduced if they stay with their mom for more and more days so now get on to the deworming part you have to deworm from the starting of the 20 days from then onwards you have to keep on deworming every 15 days okay this every 15 days gapping must be kept for at least 5 month of age of your dog okay your dog if your puppy if it's in excess in size i mean like great dane or any other pups which are in small in puppyhood only they are very big in size they may they may go to the tablets okay deworming tablets available in market but if your puppy is very small and you can deworm it with the liquid dewormers okay liquid dewormers are the most effective deworming medicine for your puppies and they are just brought like in liquid boxes with a dropper with it 
and with every body weight you have to feed them the medicine so if your dog's body weight let's say that it's 2 kg okay if it is 2 kg then you have to give 2 ml if it is 5 kg body weight then you have to give 5 ml body weight equals to that much ml that is the rule of deworming your dog with the liquid dewormers now if your dog gets to that and body weight which you can't fulfill with the liquid dewormers then you start the tablets but this puppy dewormer must be given at every 15 days gapping so that your puppy doesn't get infected with the worms at all because they get worm toxemias and their poop will contain the worms their intestinal tract will be perforated by the worms which will cause parvo parvo and many other infections which will be very very much deadly for your puppy so it's very very much important so that you deworm them it's must and must for your dogs so that they get deformed like let me give you few examples like the deformers are available in india in our country like kiev of jonthal puppy others are like warmex this are all important deworms this all contains that palmonet like pyrantol palmonet and embryonet this are the composition of it and fibrantol is also present you will get deworms with palmonet component uh, palmonet compositions but you will get fibrantol composition medicines also which are very less in cost you may think that you may think that that sheep medicine sheep goat deworming medicines are also good for our dogs i know they are very much good for your dogs but and it's very less costly too but it doesn't takes away all the worms from your dog it only treats few worms which are only common common in sheep goat cow in this kind of animals you can feed that only fibrantol composition but when you get a puppy you must feed them the puppy dewormers which are specifically made for your dogs okay which will be made for dogs only no other animals it's only for dogs now every animal needs deworming i will discuss that later but you have to deworm them and while deworming before deworming you have to give any kind of liver guard and after you have done the deworming date comes you deworm them then after again you have to give them liver guards liver guards are like hepa mast leaf 52 which is very easily available in the markets this kind of liver guards in syrup form you have to buy you have to give at least 5 ml to 10 ml to every puppy before you deworm them each time you deworm them before that you 3 days you have to give the liver guard and after deworming you also have to give 3 days the liver guard this liver guard will help your pup to protect the liver from this dose of medicine do not overdose your puppy which is not good and if you give the dose less then it will not be very much helpful for your puppy because the infection will because the worm will not die completely if you give less medicine so whatever your body's dog's body weight is equal to that you have to give the ml remember that before vaccination you have to deworm them and every 15 days you have to deworm them so that they stay free of worms and all the nutrients they get by eating the food gets all absorbed in their growth and not to the worms you feed them for their own good not for the worms you understand if you see your dog getting thinner or it has a potted belly which looks like a balloon blotted balloon then your puppy is containing high amount of worms which is causing this kind of problems worm causes many other problems like your dog will lose its ability to absorb the food in its body it will look very thin as if it has not eaten anything for many days but it's not the fact it is getting thinner and thinner because of the worms because they are growing inside its stomach and preventing it from its growth preventing your dog from its growth so you understand how much important the deworming is so do follow 
the rules of deworming. I'm going to give you a summary also. Okay. Thanks for watching my video. Hope you like, share and subscribe.